and now to the love of my life, Jess. I'm sure you'll agree how amazing she looks today. Words cannot express the depth of my love for you. Jess, you always ask me why I love you. And I never really answer. I never do. I laugh harder with you. I feel myself with you. I trust you with me. If something goes wrong or I hear a funny joke or something absolutely bizarre, I have to share it with you immediately. I knew early on that I'd call you my wife. I just wanted to wait nine years to be double and treble sure, just in case, you know, as, as you do. I mean, you never do enough, you can never do enough for people and you always put everyone first and it's a trait that I absolutely love about you. Beautiful inside and out. And I know, you know, I'm so proud to call you my wife. My rock, my best friend, my partner and everything we do, we do everything together. And it's just your cautious approach sometimes. It, it stops me getting in a lot of trouble. And I know I don't say it enough, but how proud I am of, of everything you do in your job, in life. It just keeps us. You know, we, we would be nothing, nothing without you. And today just doesn't happen. You've worked so hard and it's absolutely perfect, like you are. And without a pause of a heartbeat, I would choose you every time. So I'd like everyone to join us in a toast to the new chapter in our lives. So please, can everyone be upstanding and raise your glass glasses to my beautiful wife, Jessica. Yeah. ring as a symbol of our marriage. All that I am I give to you. All that I am I give to you. All that I have I share with you. All that I have I share with you. For the whole of our life together. For a whole of our life together. I give you this ring as a symbol of our marriage. All that I am I give to you. All that I am I give to you. All that I have I share with you. All that I have I share with you. For the whole of our life together. For the whole of our life together. Look forward confidently to a future in which you and the world in which you live and work will be the better and happier for this joyful occasion. This gives me the greatest of pleasure to say that you are now husband and wife. Congratulations, you may now kiss. We are delighted to present to you our Mr. and Mrs. Rigo. There are a couple of things, of course, I must mention. Firstly, I must mention how beautiful Jessica looks today. I've always said she's a very beautiful young woman. But today, she's absolutely breathtaking. I wrote that before I actually seen her. And I can say when I did see her, it was breathtaking. It did have a breath breath away. And I was, I did have a few tears of hers. So I'm very, very proud of you, lovely. But all any father wants for his children to be is be happy. The biggest compliment I can pay Rob is that Jessica has never been happier than she is today. So Rob, I'm very proud and happy to welcome you into our family. Kathy and I have very recently celebrated our 30th wedding anniversary. 
and I sincerely hope that Marjorie Robin Jessica will be as happy as I was. So please, everyone, be upstanding and raise your glasses to the new Mr. and Mrs. Regal. you by and that was definitely true for us the universe works in funny ways but its timing couldn't have been more perfect than when it brought us together honestly i still feel the same butterflies being with you today as when you picked me up for our first date a whole nine years <laughs> three weeks and four days ago I knew that. <laughs> we've had plenty of adventures since then and it's been a privilege to have spent almost the last decade with you I'm so excited to spend our remaining decade side by side. You're the strongest, hardest working person I know. You're the most incredible dad and stepdad our children could have wished for. You're their steady rock and their guide and hand in their lives as much as you are in mine. We're so blessed to have you. Thank you for choosing me to be your partner in this life and the commitment you make to us as a family. So, finishing off all the toasts and speeches I wanted to make a final toast for the love of my life to Robbie, to Robbie. the groom <laughs> okay you can all eat now <laughs>